Now, every songwriter's greatest fear, even greater than writer's block, is subconscious plagiarism. If you have any credibility, you're going to make sure you don't consciously rip off anybody's song. But in the back of your mind, you may have an idea that you think is your own that actually came from something else you heard. Anything you write, the inspiration comes from somewhere. You'll even find that many classic songs all have very similar chords and melodies. I mean, that's, that's where styles come from. But there's a certain point at which it's just the same person's innovation that you're copying, and that's when it's plagiarism. There have been some very famous cases with plagiarism. Um, George Harrison was sued for a song of his that was considered to be a ripoff of an older um, Motown song. Once you write a song, you should check to see if anyone else has written the same song. So go through your CDs, go through your MP3s, whatever, take a listen, and see if anything sounds familiar. Usually, everything's fine. Every once in a while I hear something and I hear a similarity and I say, oh, that's too close. So then show it to your friends and, and see what they say. Ask them to be honest. You don't want people to flatter you here. You want the truth. And if they say it sounds similar, then you might want to consider reworking an idea, even just a little bit to make it different enough. But uh, a lot of times you're going to think something sounds really similar and other people just aren't going to hear it. This has happened to me plenty of times where I've written a song and I thought, oh, that's way too close and someone else will hear it and say, what are you talking about? That doesn't sound anything like that. The important thing to remember is that even if you're drawing on someone else's idea subconsciously, as long as you're providing a unique approach to something, you're fine. The only time you're really going to get in trouble for any kind of plagiarism is when you're visible enough that you're already pretty famous. So if you, know, if you get to the point where you're getting sued like George Harrison did, you can say, well, at least I'm George Harrison, that's not so bad.